welcome back. Thanks for staying with us here on Midday Kentucky. I am so excited that the Newport Aquarium is back, and this time they brought sharks. And along with the sharks, we have Scott Brehub here in the studio. Thank you for coming right. in today. How's it going? So this is what the mobile aquarium on wheels. Yes. What is this? This is the mobile shark touch tank. Okay. Um, this <laughs> is a way that we can take ambassador animals like these coral cat sharks here okay. out to schools and libraries and. TV stations like this, and and let people get that personal connection with these wild animals. And this is the only one of its kind. This in, is in the, the only one of its kind in, its, in the country. Um, wow. We also operate our uh, Wave Foundation operates a uh, ray touch tank also, so smaller okay. stingrays that they can take out in the same fashion as this. Uh, so who do we have with us today? What kind of sharks are these? Again? These are called coral cat sharks. Okay. So b roughly about four to five years old right now. Okay. Um, they. Will not get much bigger than this. They're mm -hmm. about 24 inches at full grown. Um, so they're a, a perfect animal, a perfect species of shark to use to take out in a situation like this. Where would they naturally live? Uh, naturally, you'd find them in the Western Indo Pacific. Okay. Um, so warmer water, 76, 78 degrees around the reef structures. And that's what using a species like this allows us to have the ability to touch them because they'll be wedging themselves into rocks. Wedging themselves into little small areas, so stuff touching them, stuff okay. being on them, isn't going to bother them at all. Okay, so walk us through the process of how people touch the sharks. Um, I'll contemplate trying. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you, these guys are really cool to see how they, their, their skin feels. Oh, kids have to love this. Uh, yes, they absolutely love this, and it's always the two-finger touch. We don't want to okay. pull, we don't want to grab, anything like that. But these guys, all sharks have um, skin that is covered in what's modified teeth called okay. denticles. So they have this either rougher to silky feeling. These guys are fairly smooth compared to other sharks. So when you do touch them, okay. <laughs> they have more of a silky uh, soft sandpaper feel to them. Okay, so do you want to demonstrate? I will demonstrate. Do they Two fingers. Oh, and see, he doesn't even mind. And most of the time, if they're just <laughs> laying down, they're not even going to move. <laughs> All right. Well, tell us some more information on the shark. Some people are, are surprised about these guys. Uh, yes. They're, I mean, they're, they're, they're smaller species of sharks. Like I said, they're not going to get much bigger than this. Um, so we have at the aquarium, we have larger species of sharks that you can touch in our okay. shark touch tank. Um, and so this is a species that we chose that stays smaller for this purpose right here. And you really are a shark expert, right? Walk us through kind of what you're involved with um, at the aquarium. I'm, I'm a shark biologist, so okay. I do take care of sharks. I feed them. I know um, through my studies, I know the natural history of them and okay. what is the, the proper things for them to eat, the proper behaviors for them to be exhibiting. And that lets me give them excellent care. And why is it so important to have something mobile like this where kids can really get involved or touch these sharks? I know you go to libraries, schools, things like yeah, that. It's, it's a great tool to foster that, that personal connection with the wild animals. Okay. And that, that helps, especially at the young age, taking it to younger kids at schools and libraries, starts that idea of conservation and saving and preserving the natural animals out there. All right, and this is a great time to visit the aquarium. What do you have going on? This is. Uh, currently, right now, we have going on Winter Family Days. So with every paying adult, you get a child in for free. Um, it's cold out there. The aquarium is a nice 74 degrees. And you come in, take your coat off, get to touch sharks like this, get to touch stingrays or stingray, or, uh, stingray hideaway. All right, I'll give it a try. So. You going to try it? It won't t turn around and bite me. It will me. not turn around <laughs> and bite you. Are kids ever scared? Uh, I wouldn't say scared. Some of them are apprehensive. But kids. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. But everyone should come out there and give it a try, right? Yes, is this exactly. All, is this exhibit always available at the aquarium? You have the stingrays as well. We have the stingrays touch. and we have our shark central, which is our shark touch tank that is always okay. there. Um, and that's where you can touch the bigger species of sharks. All right. Well, like we mentioned, a perfect time to get out and check out the Newport Aquarium. We have all the information up on the screen. We'll also post this over on our Facebook page. Scott, thank you for coming in You're and bringing welcome. these cuties with you. <laughs> we'll be back after this break with more Midday Kentucky.